Hi friends and welcome back. So today's video, I'm actually still not sure what I'm going to call it because it's kind of like a, uh, it's not really a haul, but it's like kind of a haul because I'm going to show you guys what I got in from um, the trades I made on the buy sell trade group um, from Scrollfins Co. So it's not, it's kind of a haul, but it's not like super a haul. And also I was going to talk about like my experience with buy sell trade. Um, just because I thought people might be interested. It's something that I always think of in like on the back burner. So like anytime I do a D stash or a random kit like pull or something, I always know that I can do this with Scroll Prince Co. specifically, which makes me feel more confident or like better about trying like a random pull because they're easy to either trade or um, sell very easily. Um, either obviously like on Instagram, which I do actually like selling stuff on Instagram a bit better, but also on the Facebook page, there's just lots of people there as well. So just a little talk about that. I traded three different kits um, and I'm really happy with the kits that I got. They're a lot more me. The other kits, I I really didn't like one of them and the other two were kind of okay, but the kits I have now are just like so, so much better. So. I'm really happy that I picked these ones up. Um, like this one in specific, I've been looking for for a minute. I really, really like this kit. And I guess it's like a year old. But I remember when I saw it, I was like, oh, that's cute. <laughs> this is one of the kits that actually encouraged me to subscribe to the mystery kit. So that's pretty much it with like the intro. I'll just like show you guys what I got. Um, but yeah, I just thought it would be cool to kind of like talk about that. And like, I would love to know your experience on trading or selling your kits i found success like selling my kits and stuff on my instagram as well um just in case i don't like them or i just like can't find them under trade stuff like that but yeah it's worked out really nice so i will show you what i got so this is obviously the august 2020 mystery kit from scribble prince co i'm going to take it out a little sell so you can see it but i really 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 love this kit i just think it's so pretty i love this like maroon color that's in like the hat and like the sunglasses and her shirt. I just think this is so cute. And I don't, we don't have like a road trip plan. Well, I guess it's not technically true. We kind of do. So actually coming up, we're going, it's not really a road trip, but we are taking the car and going driving somewhere. We're going to go to Palm Springs. Um, I guess by the time this video goes up, it'll be pretty soon. But for 4th of July, um, we're going to go to Palm Springs. So that's kind of road trip, but like not really. This seems like a more like real real road trip but then we also are going to a wedding that's like kind of like a drive away so that will be a road trip but i think i'm going to use a um wedding kit for that month or for that week too but i just think it's like a nice fall kit regardless i might actually use this for when eventually we're going to go do some like apple picking and you have to kind of drive a little bit far out to do that because the vineyards are kind of like further out so i might use that for this because it's kind of like fall and I think that might be kind of cute. I'm probably going to take my boyfriend's nephews when we go. So I think that would be really fun. But I love this and I think I want to use copper. I guess I should like walk you through the kit format. <laughs> I'm just like blabbing about this. Um, I think I'm going to use copper foil with this kit. It's just super cute. This is an older version. It's last year's August mystery. So it's a little bit older. But I still do really like it. I like this car um, full box. I also am filming in like a different setup. So I'm actually able to look at the screen while I'm filming now. So it'll be more in frame and I can do it a little bit tighter. But that's why I'm looking at it. I, I'm kind of, my fingers are like a little bit off because I'm not just like looking at what I'm doing. I'm looking at it through the camera, if that makes sense. But I like this and I really like this olive, or yeah, kind of like olive green color. I think it's really cute. Um, we've got the heart checklist, which um, I think they're going away from kits now, but they used to be in there. And then obviously the rounded boxes, my least favorite page, honestly, but we got some square boxes up here, got some more patterns, icons, some labels and some little things. And then the washi, the washi's okay to me. Um, I'm not in love with it, but I would, if I can find in my collection, like a nice maroon color, I think that would be like really, really pretty to bring out or even all green to bring out some of the colors that I really, really like. And I think like a copper, slash rose gold like fake rose gold not like pink rose gold but the other rose gold I think would be really pretty with this kit just something warm toned or actually if there was a foil that was like this kind of maroony color I think that would be really pretty too but 
there's that. So that's the first one that I got. And actually, the one that I traded with actually sent me some extra goodies, which I will show you. I always like to send out little things with mine, but I wanted to show you what she sent me. She actually asked me about some of them, and then some of them were surprised. So I'll show you the surprise one first. I think these are from the Honey Bee Shop. These were a little surprise, and they're just so stinking cute. Like, look at that. And then also, this looks like a mermaid to me, which, you know, I love a good mermaid. Super cute, and I love the pink hair and, like, the foil on the little bubbles. So that's super cute. And then we've got another, another mermaid with fun hair. That. So I just thought that was really sweet. She, like, totally didn't have to do that. But she did, which was so nice. And then she asked me before she sent me stuff if I would want these because she had gotten them like in like a random pull or like a rack or something but um she was like she wasn't going to use them and she was like oh would you like them and I was like um sure so I'll show them to you so we've got this little girl in like a trash can <laughs> kind of funny it's from the penny pages fall oh, put it down it's a little bit easier to see from the penny pages I don't know if her shop is still open but if you guys are interested you can go and check it out just kind of cute little icon this girl is on a bike and then this is, um, she's going to like the doctor or she's a doctor. Really cute. And it's like a cool paper. It's not, maybe it's like ultimate matte. Cause it's like more like a premium. It's not just like a plain matte. It's like a little bit more buttery. This is kind of funny to me. It says, um, well you can read it, but I, I feel like if I say it, it might think I'm saying like the actual word. So, um, but it's kind of cute. <laughs> it's funny. And she's in a little fox outfit. And then <laughs> these ones are the Baby Yodas, um, I think. I'm not super into that, so I don't know if I'm going to keep these um, or what, but it was kind of nice. It was really sweet of her just to send me all this stuff. And then I really love these um, the bathtub ones because I, I love to take a bath. I really do. And then some little Etsy ones, which are cute. And then like even Etsy sales. And this could be for sticker sales or anything else you buy on Etsy. And then little Amazon ones. There's like a lot. It was really sweet of her to send this all to me. And then these girls at their computer. That is so me, like at work. So, love that. So I just wanted to include that. Then the next kit is from Scrollfriends Co. again. Um, and it's called Summer Nights. And I'm really excited about this kit. This kit actually just showed up. So it's the last kit I was waiting for before I filmed this. And if you guys have seen my haul, you saw the kits that I traded these for. Um, but I traded for like three different kits. And these ones are just a lot more in style, I think. But I'm really, really excited about this one. So this is Summer Night. And you guys know that I love the like purple, blue color scheme. So this is really pretty much made for me. And actually, I'll give you a little sneak peek. But this, I'm really excited about this coming in because I'm doing a collab a little bit later. I think in August with Jen. From Jen Joy Plans. I'm really excited. We're going to use this kit together. So that'll be really fun. Um, but I love these colors. So bright and vivid. I just, I'm really happy. I like how bathing suit, like literally this color too. So really cute. Look like at this ice cream. Like that looks so cool. I don't know. I just really like this. I love the colors. So that's that. And so it's the same format as the kits that I traded for. Like a little bit of an older format but these colors come on i love it it's like the purple blue it's it's all me and this bottom wash is like kind of cool at first i was like i don't know if i like it but it's kind of cool i just don't think i would use any overlay or anything on it i think i would just leave it kind of plain maybe you could do an overlay on this box but i think you just kind of leave it as like the tides i just think that's kind of cool i don't know so that is the second kit summer night I'm really glad that I switched this one out. I was like really hoping I could get someone to trade this one. Literally all the kids actually. I was, they, they were the ones I was hoping for. So really excited. So then the last and final kit is of course another Girlfriend's Co. Um, mystery. So it's the September mystery from 2020. I mean, it's purple. So you know that I love it. <laughs> I just, I really love the purple kits. And it goes to be really fun. Um, kind of like winter before or after when I start my Christmas kits. 
I just think it's really fun and like the evergreen candle. I'm big into candles year round, but especially during the cooler months. And like this purple jacket, I wish. And the shoes, I wish, guys. And I also like that they have like brown wood behind it. I just think that's really nice. The snow, it's not like the typical snow cabin kit where it's like really muted. I feel like there's a lot of colors. Um, it's like the navy and the purple together. I just really like it. Um, this is like a little bit more muted, more like typical, but I feel like all the other boxes pretty much, it's just like really cute. And there's a little deer. I forgot to mention this. Look at this little deer. So stinking cute. You know, I love these. I love it. I love it. And then the purples is just so cute. So cute. And so both of the mysteries just came as like the kit. They didn't include any extras because I don't think all of them had extras in this stash box mine the one that i traded this um woman for had a foil bundle but because she didn't have foil bundle she agreed that i could keep my foil bundle and we would just exchange kits and it was a gold foil bundle anyway so i was happy to do that because i don't really have that many gold foil bundles so they're kind of more rare for me <laughs> to have i just like this i think the pattern is cute the little plaid and then, ugh, these colors i love these colors i love them so much <laughs> And I love this wood grain. I think this is so stinking cute. It really balances out the kit. And then we have the extra girls, which are really cute. I don't really like this dog, not gonna lie, but there's enough boxes I feel like that I don't need to include it. But yeah, it's really cute. Maybe we'll go somewhere snowy, but I don't really think so. We'll see. So that is the end of my BST haul slash just showing you what I got and walking you through my little buy-sell trade experience. I hope you guys like this video. If you did, like it and subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye, friends.